really an under the radar, doesn't get a lot of love, but it basically is critical to life as we know it. Boron is the fifth element on the periodic table. It has very unique chemical properties. It's light, it's heat resistant, energy dense, microbial. Uh, and I use the analogy that if Tony Stark, if you're a Marvel fan, were to build a Iron Man suit, it's actually a boron based suit, but doesn't get a lot of attention. Um, so boron goes into some really boring stuff, glass or ceramics, cleaning supplies. And then on the glass side, it goes into all forms of glass. That's LCD, that's Pyrex, uh, it's also textile fiberglass. And then it goes into some really important uh, specialty boron applications. So take boron carbide, that's the third hardest material on planet Earth. That's what they use to make uh, Kevlar and, and tank armor. It goes into ferroboron. There's a ton of attention on the neodymium rare earth permanent magnets. Those magnets actually are ND for the neodymium, Fe iron, B boron. And so there's about 2% of the one and a half, two percent of the magnet is actually the boron. But if you look at the caggers that are attributable to permanent magnets and whether it's driven by AI, electric vehicles, wind, uh, the world's going to need more high performing magnets. And so that's going to require more boron.